sometimes you just want a good old fashioned breakfast McDonald's and that's it and don't have to pay all the extra stuff. I'm sorry. Sometimes you just you just want some reheated McDonald's. <laughs> you know? Sometimes it's all you want in the morning. time to get a parking out here is in the morning and it's raining but right now I'm at the town of Jackson and I'm at the free parking finally got into this joint and the only time to get in here is if it's like a dreary day <laughs> but I'm gonna go and I'm gonna see if I can get my picture with the with the, the antlers of the you know the iconic Jackson antlers and go from there but um and now i'm gonna show you guys around the this this part of the town there's like another part of the town a little bit further up but i'm gonna show you guys more of this because this is where this is what you come into when you're coming from the grand tetons you're coming all the way from here so right now in the shops i'm here early because of course the only time you get here then you're early and um i'm here early so some of the businesses are going to be closed but um i'm just gonna show you what i can show you <laughs> and show you what you're what you're getting into but if you come early i know this last time i was here i left at my campground early it was kind of you got you can get some parking in the free parking area and make sure you're i would highly recommend you parking in the public parking areas you park on these streets you, you it's a good luck because your car may get towed it's like one of those towns you know in the, uh, in the city you, you, you don't want to park here if you don't have to park here if there's free parking somewhere, park it. It's like, there's two places where you have these parking lots. One up here, I think one like up here somewhere and over, over there. And then no, no, it's over here. No, it's one up here and I think, no, I think it could be one over there that was free parking. You just gotta find them. But, um, but I would park in those areas. But if you're coming in the afternoon, forget it. You're not, you're not parking anywhere because this is, it just gets jam packed. Go ahead. <laughs> I try to run across these streets. <laughs> but it's a small community here. Now there's some some areas where they're getting modernized and I'm like, I don't know. I see like a lot of kids shoot boots here. What is it? I saw one in the park when I was going on a hike and one right there. It's so weird. So like I noticed in, in Jackson Hole, they're doing like a lot of modernized stuff, like buildings, and I'm like, that type of thing can kind of take away from the the rustic look of the area. That's something they you know yeah look out for them. Ah, uh, camping. There's a lot of camping gear here. That's <laughs> funny. And also the thing is if you park on the street, it's it's very small space. And sometimes and I don't I don't have a I don't like park, parking in small spaces. I take my chances somewhere else. Well, it's got a birch here somewhere. <laughs> Restaurant. They're doing a lot of construction here. They're building buildings and everything. Well, they only got a short, a short window, so this this construction can take years. <laughs> Whatever they're doing.
see the reason why we went to McDonald's. There's a lot of lines out here. And I was not going to be sitting in line just to get something to eat real fast. You know, sometimes you just, you know, you just want some, you want some McDonald's. You know? You just want some McDonald's. Ooh, what's the best like that? Of antlers right here. Elk antler arches. The antler arches have been gated gates to the Jackson Town Square since 1960. The antlers are from elk that winter on the National Elk Refuge. About um, 3,500 elk spend each winter on the refuge. The bulls shed their elk antlers each spring. Antlers are picked up by the local Boy Scouts and sold by public auctions in the square each May. All four um, arches were built by Jackson Hole Rotary, 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 Rotary Club. All four arches were built by Jackson Hole Rotary Club. Okay, that's the arches. All right, here. Yeah. They have on they have on each area like one, two, and there's one down there, three, and then there's one down there, which is four. gift shops because a lot of them have some like some very awesome teas. Where's the thing at? They don't have one over here? I guess they don't. Nah, this one, this one doesn't have it. The other one does. And sometimes they have little flaggers. You hold the flag out <laughs> across the street over. It's weird. I'll show you what that looks like. It's fun. See, at some of these spots, they'll have little... This is actually a main street, so that's why they have these little flaggers here. Um, just to give you a heads up. So if you do want to cross the street, you have to hold the flag out and cross the street, because there's no, the lights all the way down there, so this is what you'll have to do. You take one of these out, and you hold it like this. And you gotta, you gotta look both ways. <laughs> you cross the street. <laughs> and you hold it like this. And then you put it back. Just like that. And then there you go. Ba -ba -ba. <laughs> That's kind of fun. I just wanted to show you guys that. See, I walked the extra mile for you guys.
Thank you guys for watching. Please keep subscribing to Coast Guy Adventures and also follow me on Facebook and also follow me on Instagram. Uh, subscribe and I will see you guys later. Bye.